Hello guys, welcome back to Algorithms Made Easy. We will be solving the day 16 problem from the May Lead Coding Challenge. We are given a linked list. We need to group all odd nodes together followed by all even nodes. It is mentioned that we need to group them on the basis of node number and not on node value. We need to perform it in place so we cannot use extra space. Let's see how we can solve it. Think of this solution in a way where we need to unweave a linked list. The algorithm works in that way only. Firstly, we will check if the list is empty or have only one node. In that case, we simply return the head. Now, we initialize variables even head, current even and current odd. They will store references. We will loop till both the current even and current odd is not null. Now, here we write the unweaving logic. If the next of current odd is equal to current even, then we update the current odd next with current even next. Now, if updated current odd next is not null, we move current odd to its next. Else, if next of current even is equal to current odd, then we update the current even next with current odd next. Now, we move current even to its next. After the loop is terminated, we will have two lists, one with odd number of nodes and other with the even number of nodes. We will join them by updating the next of current odd to even head. In the end, we will return the head. In the given example, we have a linked list. The first node will be our head. Now let's initialize the variable. First is the current odd. This will hold the reference to the odd node. As the first node in the odd list will be the head, so initially it will store that. Moving on to current even. The node next to head or the second node in the list will be our first even node. So initially current even will store that. And so it will also be our even head. We will now start iterating over the linked list with the condition that both current even and current odd are not null. We will check if next of current odd is equal to current even. If it is true, we move forward. First, we have to update next of current odd to next of current even. Once we do that, we check if the next of current odd is not null. As it is not, we will update it to its next. This completes our first iteration, not again checking if the current even or current odd is null. As they are not, we enter the loop. We check if next of current odd is equal to current even. As it is not, we move to the else part. We will update next of current even with next of current odd. Then we update current even to its new next. This completes our two iterations. Loop condition is still true so we enter again. The if condition satisfies so we apply both the operation. Now going in loop again if condition is false so we go to else part and execute both statements. Now as current even becomes null we terminate the loop. If we pull aside the two list it will be more clear to us that we have successfully separated even and odd number nodes. As we need odd number nodes first followed by even, we join both. We update the next of current odd with even head. This joins the two list. When we flatten out this new list, it is indeed the result that we wanted. Here is the actual code snippet for the method. Also, check the link to the Java code in the description below. The time complexity of this algorithm is O of n and the space complexity is O of 1. Thanks for watching the video. Check out link to the Java code in the description below. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe the channel. Check out my other videos for more interview problems. Let me know in the comment section what you think about the video. And also, if you want me to make a video on one of your problem statements, do comment.